Good evening, special guests, representatives, and staff of the First T Network, the many business and community leaders in attendance, and my fellow First T participants. My name is Gary Jones, Jr. I'm 16 years old, and I've been a member of the First T of Hampton Roads since I was four years old. Thank you. Thank you. The First T means more to me than just golf. My experiences, involvement, and the many individuals who have touched my life has been truly amazing, and I'm truly appreciative of that. The various aspects of the program and the nine core values have been uniquely instilled in me. Core values are simply the way you live and conduct yourself. My parents have stressed that values are what you are, not what you want to become. I have learned that my core values should be more than just mere words, but the very center of who I am. Tonight, I want to share with you what integrity means to me. So I was thinking about multiple definitions, where should I start, I didn't know where to go, so I just pulled out the dictionary. And so I said, integrity says the quality of being honest and having strong moral principles or moral uprightness. The, the, the two words that really stuck out to me was moral principles and moral uprightness. Those words, because we've all heard of moral courage, which is exactly what this is. You've heard of the physical courage of a firefighter, police officer, soldier, but moral courage is standing true to your principles regardless of the situation you find yourself in. Integrity, thank you. And the physical courage is just the response to a given set of conditions. But integrity and the moral courage it requires establishes the roadmap for how I must live on a day-to-day -day basis. Integrity is not like a special hat, special outfit, special routine I use on the golf course or that I change in different situations, but integrity is how I consistently live each and every day. Having integrity requires me to be the same person no matter what the situation is and doing the right thing even when nobody's looking. Two important traits of integrity are honesty and truth. To have true integrity, these principles must be standard and not optional. Tony Dungy, a former NFL football player and coach, once said, integrity to me is what you are all about. It's what's inside of you, and what's inside is eventually going to come out during a critical situation. That to me is the difference between a good team and a championship team. How, how has integrity impacted me? I believe that integrity is the core value that has most shaped me into the person I am today and the person I hope to ultimately become. Integrity has made me aware of being, of, of being self-governing, regardless of what others do or don't do. I would like to share a quick story of how integrity served me well a couple years ago. Uh, I was at a restaurant with my dad, and uh, there was these windows looking out, and I saw a man and his wife walking their child to the car. And when he was putting his child in the back seat, I noticed his wallet fell out of his back pocket. And I'm like, kind of expecting him to pick it up once, once he closes the door. But I see him getting in the driver's side, and I'm like, Oh, oh crap, I gotta go pick this up. <laughs> so I run outside, so I run outside and uh, I, I quickly stop him before he can drive off. And uh, I, I explained to him what happened, but he, he thanked me over and over for stopping him. And uh, you know, it's something very small, but it's something I would never forget because integrity is always about doing the right thing even when nobody's looking. Thank you for allowing me to share my story. Thank you for allowing me to share my story. This week has been a blast. I'm truly grateful for it and the first tea. Thank you. Have a great evening.